that is you. Hello views, this is Mr. Roblox Indonesia. And welcome to another weapon development video. In today's transition period, we will be upgrading the two main ace ranged weapons in the game. It's been 7 months now, since we upgraded the weapons. Man, it feels like yesterday. And don't worry about you too. I will upgrade you guys in the next update. Hi hi. While also fixing some of the bugs from this update. Now, who's no? It's hard snakes now. I honestly didn't expect this to be a 3 day development. It seems like I'm getting older. Since my speed of development has been reduced. <laughs> well, in another way, if you've seen the clip from the beginning of this video, then you guys already know what's wrong with the current weapon and why I need to change or upgrade it. Especially with the green store mark bird, wooden 01. Which gives the player a high amount of speed, to the point of resurrecting the name of this game. Even though it was pretty fun to play with, it can cause an imbalance in the universe. Which is why I need to change it. And don't worry, I won't remove it completely. It pretty much gives me an idea for the next weapon or till edition update. Well, enough for a long explanation. It's time to break down what I want to change or add to this green flammer thrower thing. The first one was to have better fire control. Which is something that the previous versions of this weapon didn't have, and it pretty much does not feel like a flammer thrower at all. The second one was to remodel the entire weapon. Since it's a bit simple and gigantic. With that done. I start searching for references, adding a better hitbox, that looked like a birthday party hat. Next was mutating a bit of the script. Then, a bit of testing what the fuck. Well, it seems like some of the changes make me feel like sinking a titanic ship. After some welding fixing. The next step was to change the fire effects, which are required for the script to function. Then, after a long rewrite and mutation of the code, from the tutorial with some random error stabs around the humanoid detection, it finally works. Then, I add the get kills function to the script, to give the player kills and felt all money. With that bug roaming my game. For now I'm going to remove the humanoid function to solve the issue. While the clock had passed 0.00, .00 I added a fire effect, which prevented the computer from reading the code line. Later on, after the fix, I recall all the fire effects to green. Then, after 9 hours, I began remodeling the XAW01. Which is heavily inspired by the boring company's flammer thrower and a little bit of the TF2 flammer thrower. And after some drawing, this will be our new design for the green store mark bird.
After the remodeling phase is done, let's test how it's going to feel like. Apparently, the bug in high speed mode is still lingering. So, how do you fix this? Well, at first, I was thinking of making an idle animation. That looked like this. So it could break the one side mass. That caused the acceleration of player speed. Then, after making the key poses for 18 minutes, and adding the script, to make the animation exist, it broke the tools. Hey yo, what the f- What? What the f- Later, I decided to make an extension of the idle animation and a walking animation that, later on, I scrapped because of how ugly it is. Well, viewers, for the last two days, I've only upgraded the XAW01, which has now been named XAW02. Now, I will focus on the next beauty, the Sun Launcher. In case you haven't watched my fourth devlog video, and then it worked. It was a false advertisement. Since the bug was still flying around the game to this day, that's why I decided to upgrade, change, or revamp some of the stuff with the SAR launcher. But first, let's remodel it, because it's going to be hard to test the script, since it needs to be welded first. Yo, 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 yo. Ah! Alright, after the remodeling phase is done, I start adding a smoke effect, search for a rocket launcher tutorial, and begin rewriting the entire code. After millions of tests, the rocket pathway seems to be working, but when the explosion hits, it does not detect and kill the player. So I searched for another answer, and it was found in the least expected place, the Roblox Creator Hub. Without wasting any time, I began to rewrite all the codes on the Roblox Creator Hub, and... It works. Booyah! Then I started to add some other functions, like the get kills function, the team detection function, and the reload function. Following the long multiplayer testing, I encountered the XAW02 infinite kills and money bug again. Then, after adding the debounce with a wait function, which is works. Nice. Then, after all that, I released the update. Thanks for watching.